Can I pray for you? Can I pray for you? Can I pray for you? Come on. Come on. Hey, hi, 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 hi. No? It will never happen. Whatever that you are thinking, it will never happen. You are saying what? Everything. She will never touch. You are saying what? She will never touch. She will never touch. Whatever that you are praying about, she will come, never touch. Come, come, come. Uh, as we are touching you, Jesus will set you free. friends that were having guns around you? I have some of them. Huh? I was having them. And they never gave you a gun? No. So now, I want to pray for you. Jesus loves you. Amen. You hear me? Amen. Uh, because when I touch you here, I'm seeing a life of the dark. And it's God that is bringing you out. Amen. You hear me? Amen. Uh, because you saw that there's danger coming. But I was just shocked that when I, why, when I touch you, I see guns, 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 guns around you. So I want to tell you, Jesus loves you. Amen. You hear me? Amen. You give your life to Christ, you hold Jesus, everything will work out for you. Amen. Leave him, it's free. Yeah, it is true. The man of God. Uh, tell me that he seen he see a gun in my life. Then me, I don't have a guns. But the friends that I was having, they were having guns. Now I feel relieved because of it was a burden on me. Yes, I was always praying for God to to uproot or to to reveal any hidden thing that is inside of me. For me to give my life to Christ was a wonderful thing because of I was a Jesus taken from the, the from the death of my life. The message that I have for the people, I can say people must accept Jesus as their Lord and Savior because of uh, their lives without Jesus, they are in danger. You are dreaming dead people, sister. You are dreaming death. No? Yes. I see you dreaming death. Yes. It's like there was someone, you could see someone going down, as if someone has been buried. Yes. So we need to cancel this problem. Amen. You hear me? Amen. Because this is to tell you something is coming. Amen. Uh, but the blood of Jesus can close this. Amen. In Jesus' name. Come on. Come on. You're free. Mama. What the prophet was telling me is true. I used to dream dead people. So, yes. What the, pro the prophet was telling me is very true. It's been a, a, a long time. Yes. What are you doing here? I feel I'm free and I believe there will be no death in my family. No one will, will die in my family. What I can encourage people of is that there is God in this place. Come on. Jesus. I didn't know can tell a case, not to my food. You're free. Stood up, brother. This thing will kill you one day. Come on! Come on, you demon! Out! Oh! Come on! Out! You know, 
it's like your wife has made a mistake of choosing Jesus. Yes. She has, yes, she has, made, she has made a mistake. Yeah, it is true. You know, these people, they want everyone to follow the spirits of the family. Mm, yes, yeah. This Otherwise, mother. because now, see this thing, it's affecting her head now. Yes, yeah. She's affected a lot. Mm. Yeah. Come here. It's like soon it will become a stroke. Yeah. So I want Jesus uh, to heal her today. Amen. In Jesus' name. You see why she's beating why she's beating is this thing here. Come on! Are you? Are you? You demon! Sometimes when you choose God, you become an enemy to your own people. Oh, you demon! When was the last time she received a call from this man? Uh, I'm not sure, but it has been a long time. Mm. Yeah, it's been a long time. I don't know whether I should tell her to answer or not to answer it. Come on! Leave the snare, you dip. Come on! Out! Out! You are a stroke. Come on! Come on! You demon, come on. Hurry, 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 come on. Yes, um, today I received the prophecy, I and I confirm the prophecy to be true. I've been having a con like constant headaches and the problem with breathing. And the prophet today prophesied about it, and I got delivered from the spirit of headache. And he said, This is stroke. And today I'm delivered from spirit of stroke and also of breathing problem. Now I feel light, I feel, I feel delivered, I feel relieved. May the Lord be praised. I'm free, I have the grace. And I've seen God's grace working in my life. Thank you, Jesus. Believe in prophets and you shall prosper. I've seen God's grace working here in many ways. And I thank God for my deliverance. I have the grace and no one can stop me. Amen. Praise the Lord. You've got a spiritual husband. Stand up. Come on. Come on. Are you? Come on. Are you? Come on. Yes. Yes. Huh? You see what? You don't want to leave here? Eh? Huh? What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Hey, I'm just staying here. You're just staying? Yeah. You know, I see something here. Let me show you. There's something sitting here. Here. Out! You demon! Here. Come on! No, eh? I'm surprised she can't be married with this thing. It's not possible. Yeah. Sister, you've got something here. Yeah, huh? And it's painful. And it's painful. Yeah. Mm. It you are coming sometimes. here for the first time? No. Mm. I'm surprised you, she's saying you are the sister in law, and according to me, I, I don't see you married. And it will be impossible. And you know, this thing is making you to fight with this man, always. Look here, God must heal you. Amen. You hear me? Yes. So you've got children. Yes. Mm. But with this, it will be difficult to marry. Yeah, it's true. Right now, you are sick now. So God must help you. This thing must come out. Amen. Touch there. Uh, my name is Mkate Kuchahuke, and then uh, the prophet spoke with me. He told me that uh, I have a spiritual husband, and uh, something that is 
in my stomach, which is true, uh, because I used to experience pains in my stomach, and I could feel that thing moving, and it's painful. So, but now I can feel that um, I'm free. It's no longer there. Um, before I was feeling heavy, but now, like I'm, I'm free. I'm like, <laughs> I'm like that thing. Like I was. It was like I was having something, like in my body. Like, but now I can. I feel free. I'm, I'm soft. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, uh Valu Akai no uh Kwala Mitekiroko Merukona, the Banuko Shukwem Bushukona, a charis missionary church, and she melungwina core mita 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 ponisiwa, melanuko meku poniswaka mina kwala charis. So feel free to come here and get your healing. Lift your arm. You know when I'm praying for you, I'm seeing agricultural stuff. Sorry? When I pray for you, I see agricultural business. You know, these are like chickens. Yes. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on, you dick! And don't undermine it. Don't undermine it. God can bless you. Sure, this is your wife. Huh? Yes. Are you sure, sure? This woman is your wife. Yes. How sure are you? Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Yes. Sure, 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 sure. Sure, sure, sure. Mm. Lift her up. This is your first wife. No. Hmm? She's my second wife. Second wife. Yeah, no, I got married and I divorced and mm. I got married to her. That's why I say, are you sure, 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 sure? Yeah, no, she is. Ah! You know, she was, you can't hide, you can't hide from God. It's not possible. When we are, you are like a, a TV. We, you know, and many a times, spirits, they know how to deal with us. You know, one time the Bible said, there's nothing new under the sun. So, when you hear me say, are you sure, 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 sure? It's because I want him to know that this is not the first wife. And there's problems because of that. Jesus' name. What are you doing here? Huh? What are you doing? Why are you attacking this woman? Huh? Leave it, leave it. Why are you attacking this woman? Huh? Put her like this. Why are you attacking this woman? I can't hear you. Why, why are you attacking this woman? Huh? Speak, speak, you demon. Why are you attacking this woman? Huh? Why are you attacking her? Oh, do you know who's attacking the lady? You want to know? Yes. Oh, you'll be shocked. Eh? But why are you attacking her? Huh? I can't hear you. Why are you attacking her? You know. Why are you 
are attacking this woman. <gasps> Speak, you demon. Touch your stomach. Why are you attacking this lady? Huh? Why are you attacking this lady? You don't want to speak. Hmm? I'll leave you. Uh, And yes. Because I see you losing your job. Yeah, yes, I just uh, recently got a letter. Yes. You was, re just received a letter? Yeah, by email when I came on holiday now. Yeah. Mm. Yes. That's why I say to you, mm. uh, did you lose your job? Because I see you losing your job. But I see something great coming to you. Thank you, Jesus. You Thank you, me? Jesus. Yes, I heard you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. You know, that, that letter they gave you, ignore it. Yes, yes, thank you, Jesus. Don't cry. Ignore that letter. Thank There's you. something better that is coming. Yes, thank you, Jesus. Uh, yes, I just wanted to say that um, I'm Washington. I came from the UK. And uh, right now, uh, the Jesus. prophet address has just uh, said to me that obviously I see you losing your job. And uh, yes, I confirm because um, I got recently a letter saying that um, Mr. Washington, we need to check all your papers and stuff like that and uh, so please hand in and uh, yes so 100% I can 100% confirm that the man of God everything he's saying is a 100% facts and right now he just ended up saying to me that I see you even with a great job so you know what I just want to thank God for locating me right now because I just came from the UK right now as a visitor so right now I'm just honored and uh, wow God is good God is good um, first of all I looked at it but I can say this um, I didn't overthink it because I said you know what I'll deal with it when I come back because I'm on holiday right now and straight away, yeah. So I just said God would do with it. So yeah. And guess what? God is faithful. God is faithful. Oh. Uh, right now I can tell you this. Uh, I'm so emotional. I'm overwhelmed. I think you can even see right now. I'm a guy like just excited how God can locate you in your heart. You don't need to speak it too loud. No one knew about it. But God located me today just saying, Washington, I'm sorting you out ahead of time. So thank you so much. Man, people in England, all I can say is this. Uh, man, cherish God is amazing. Uh, I can 100% testify already. So many times, even in 2020, 2019, I first walked in here and I can tell you my life has been blessed and blessed and blessed. And even right now, as you can see, I'm already located. So I suggest that you hurry up from the UK. Come down here. There is so much grace here. Whoever that has been fighting you, after we lay our hands on you, I want to tell you that which will know no rest. Amen. I say that, that which will know no rest in the name of Jesus.